lower seeded team that wins tonight mm. is the lower seeded team. Uh, you know what? I usually go with, certainly if we were talking about the point spread involved here, mm -hmm. I might go with the lower seeded team, but in all four games, I'm going with the higher seeded team. So no wow. would be my answer. I do not believe that any of the lower seeded, I would love to see it happen, but I don't think it's going to happen. So hold on, let me get this straight. After picking upsets on upsets yeah. on upsets for right. the entire tournament, your bracket right. is filled with upsets. Yes. You finally listened but to me I, and went no. chalk what did for I say, though? one what night in the I NCAA say, tournament. What did I say, though, at the beginning of the tournament? You said yeah. upsets. You said pick tons no. of upsets. Exactly. You said that's rounds. how you win your pool. In the early <laughs> rounds. But then you come to chalk or closer to it where you, the teams eventually the cream rises to the top at the end. And right. So that's what I was saying. Now, it didn't work out for me because I had Villanova and Duke playing, for example, in the East region. Didn't happen. Mm -hmm. So uh, for whatever that theory is worth. But that's where I figured if you picked a lot of upsets in the first, second rounds, and then you, you end up at the end with your top teams. I have in my bracket, and I had them since the beginning, Michigan beating Oregon. So to me, that's going to be the lower seed. I believe in this Michigan team. The last 11 days, like we talked about, have been such a whirlwind for this team, starting with the plane crash, winning the conference title, winning two games in the NCAA tournament, and then I feel like they go on and beat Oregon. This is going to be a really tough Oregon team. We talked about Tyler Dorsey. We talked about Dylan Brooks. They're missing Chris Boucher, which is going to be a huge deficit for them, and I feel like Michigan takes advantage. Plus, they're just they're riding that emotional train. They don't want it to be over, and they know what that means. Uh, so, to me, Michigan is the lower-seeded team that wins tonight.